Hello and welcome to Sports Memorabilia Framing Center. Today we are framing a 16 by 20 Roy Oswalt. And we are framing that with the red outer mat and the royal blue inner mat. I'm going to go ahead and cut our royal blue inner mat. While that's being cut, I'm going to go ahead and place our hinging tape. This is an acid-free hinging tape, which means it would not damage your photo in any way. 20 years from now, you can peel it off slowly and it will not damage your photo. Cut our red outer mat. Here's our royal inner. Okay, here's our red outer. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put ATG, which is a framers grade double sided tape, on the back of our top mat. I like to get it right near the edges so that way you get that nice good adhesion on the inside. Now, I'm going to place it on top of our royal blue inner mat, make sure we get a nice quarter inch evenly all the way around. Okay, next step, a photo. We already have our hinging tape at the top, so I'm just going to place this mat over and square this off nicely and push down what tape is. And flip it over and use my burnishing bone to push down the tape make sure we get a good adhesion okay. ATG once again and our ATG is just going to hold our mat board to our foam board backing. Okay, here's our foam board. Go ahead and lie this down over the foam board. Square it off. I'm going to cut this out now. Okay. Now I'm going to take our certificate, our JSA authentication card and our sportsmemorabilia.com authentication card and place this in, in this plastic sleeve apply some ATG and stick this to the back of your photo that way you always know where your COAs are And there you have it. <clears throat> Once again, this is a 16 by 20 Phillies autographed Roy Oswalt photo. This is a red outer mat and the royal blue inner mat. Thank you for watching.